Hey there everybody, Anabrax here. Uh, I figured it was time to try some TOA. I may or may not get interrupted while I'm at it. Uh, <laughs> we'll see how it goes though. Uh, just give me a second while I use up this uh, PvP token, shall we? <laughs> hmm. We'll uh, knock it out as quick as we can. I'm not going to be able to get all of it done in this one video, but uh, yeah. <laughs> Boom! Hmm. See, Synergy guys is pretty cool, to be fair. <laughs> yeah. It's a shame that's a fire one. Doesn't quite, uh, <laughs> considering I've got two uh, talks going at it. <laughs> Man. <coughs> oh. They're pretty brutal. <laughs> Ouch. See, they're not AoE capable really, but they do okay. I mean, my rank is horribly low, but that's to be expected. I'm not at all trying yet, and they're not at all ready yet either. Alright. Back to normal difficulty, since I was doing hard on my other one. Let's see. But uh, I was gonna say I should probably use those AOEs, shouldn't I? Uh, let's take him, him, and him for the start. <coughs> See if that AOE does anything. Or his raw. I think his raw is pretty good. Can't remember. Yes, I'm cracking my knuckles in preparation for our auto. <laughs> See how far we can go. Hmm. I am. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys will be able to hear the sound properly. I'll try. I don't know if it's too loud or if it's not loud enough. We'll find out. <laughs> Hopefully the sound comes through okay for you guys. I don't know. <laughs> hmm. Hopefully my voice comes through okay. <laughs> uh, not that you guys want to hear that. You just want to see this. It's hmm. <coughs> hmm. <coughs> like, just make sure. Yeah, okay. Just want to check I was on my phone. <laughs> Ta-da! Magic pride. Hey, it takes a little longer without your AoEs. It's like, why? Why can't I just use the... Well, Rauk, really, right? Kills one thing, kills another thing, repeats. <laughs> Repeat after me, death. <laughs> to the enemy. <laughs> hmm. It's like painful to watch them get wrecked this badly. <laughs> and it's only stage 3, but still. Hmm. 
Hmm, I wonder if this thing can pause. No. Oh. I was like, I wonder if I could like potentially pause the recording and then after a break, because I'll, I'll be having dinner soon. After a break, I'll be able to just jump back into it. <laughs> oh, we'll knock out as much of this as we can now, and we can just pick it up normally in a secondary video if I need to. Of course. <laughs> Wind! <laughs> no fucks given. This is pretty much how TOA is going to go for like most of it, <laughs> to be fair. <laughs> I mean not, probably like halfway before this stops working. Just could be a little slow, well not slow going, I mean it's slower going than, um, you know, Lucian and <laughs> Poseidon. <laughs> That I'm used to. There's a um, water homunculus I use as well. I kind of just throw in AoEs. I don't even use a healer. Like, kind of me is there for the um, attack gauge increase. <laughs> just for more damage right now. But, like, come on, guys. <laughs> this is what you can turn your two star monsters into. At the very least, you'll be able to smash out the first 30 levels, which will more than help. Because tier 2A is, um, if you noticed, I think I've got, like, what, 2,000 crystals again already. Um, in, like, since my last video, I've gone up, like, almost 700 crystals. Because I've been doing World Boss, I've been doing Arena, I've been doing Guild Battles, and, yeah, like, it just, they add up, man. <laughs> They add up really quickly. Uh, you, you, know, you don't need to purchase stuff to get crystals. And once you've like, when, once you dip into like everything, you'll get them really quickly. But TOA especially. And if you want crystals, do TOA. <laughs> they can't they, like they go a long way. You should honestly, I think you should like focus on working on your TOA team. If you're going to build a team, focus on your TA team. And then focus on the other stuff. Hmm. Like, obviously you need, like, giants, at least. And then focus on your TA team. Doesn't have to be giants 10. If you got, like, you know, do TOA. Simple. Doesn't matter if you can clear giants 10 or not, just do TOA. Get as far as you can. And then, yeah go back to working on the other stuff because it's worth the energy sink and the time sink to get the rewards from this like very much so <laughs> hmm. <coughs> excuse me boss stage oh here we go <laughs> she isn't gonna know what hit her <laughs> that's what brandy I think I feel bad for her, man. I feel bad. Poor Darian. Damn. <laughs> They're gonna like F me up later <laughs> in stages. They're just gonna be like, huh, called me a week earlier? Well, I'll take this. <laughs> His defense break my face. I won't be able to kill him fast enough, and I just fucking turn around and boom, one shot me. Oh! Oh, oh shit, I wasn't. <laughs> Ouch! I wasn't expecting that, man. <laughs> I 
I mean, I was expecting them to mess stuff up. I just wasn't expecting them to, like, practically one shot her. <laughs> uh, I got no idea what, like, this health scaling for these monsters are. But, geez. The runes haven't changed since, um, like, it's only a free, re removal, free rune removal day today, and then I got no idea, like, I was, like, looking through and I'm just like, I don't really want to get in there and mess around with anything right now on either of my accounts, I just, you know, like, there's a lot of improvements that need to happen, but I feel like my problem is that I'm just not, uh, in, on my main account, is that I'm not farming Rift, uh, like for grindstones and stuff, and on this account, it's like, well, I don't really want to mess anything up that's like currently working right now. And if I do need to <coughs> modify just like one or two of them, then it doesn't really matter. The other monsters are already unruined, so I'll be putting fresh runes on them. And there's no point modifying, like, stealing from one of my other monsters right now. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> We're like, <clears throat> we just went from like super intense warmth for our summer to like, oh, it's like rainy and freezing cold for some reason, or it, it only feels freezing cold because we're so used to like <clears throat> 35 degree Celsius degree heat right now. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, so my throat's playing up after riding around in the rain a bit. <laughs> Uh. Yeah, like, you see, or you would, <laughs> if you could, see the uh, synergy there where they, um, see where they use group hunt, right? And they take old, uh, they take Royd, and he does the defense break. Well, you'll see, like, the defense break will go on, and then one of the other hits in that triple hit will get the increased damage from the defense break. It's freaking great how that works. <clears throat> it's not like none of those hits get the advantage of the defense break. It's just straight up. If he gets defense break on first before the other two, then the it counts towards their damage, which is really helpful. <laughs> hmm. Here we go. Get as far as that energy would take us. I actually have a lot of energy um, saved up from the event, <coughs> but I'm not gonna have time to use all of it before uh, dinner's ready. We're having soft shell tacos, aka burritos or kebabs. I, I don't, that always confused me. The kebabs thing. I was like, when I first heard of kebabs, I was like, oh yeah, meat on a stick. <laughs> Shows my uh, uneducated self doesn't even know his food I guess but I just always knew him as burritos so whatevs wraps etc it's gonna be delicious I know you guys probably don't want to hear about that stuff there right <laughs> I really don't have anything else to talk about or do and I figured you'd probably just be bored watching this like just watching it uh, so I'm ranting a little bit about random stuff, unfortunately for you guys. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Been playing some Mass Effect Andromeda. <laughs> I know, right? Those reviews. But, and I picked it up cheap because it was uh, given such bad ratings and stuff. And I must say, uh, I'm quite enjoying the single player campaign so far. I, like, it's been out for ages, and I heard they'd fix stuff, so I was like, alright, I'll give it a go. And I don't really have any complaints so far. I've been playing through on Insanity, messing around with all different types of builds. <coughs> Come to a, you know, I like the Sentinel. It's good stuff. Extra shielding. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I'm, like, doing a mix of, uh, what is it, Annihilation and Lance at the moment for single player, but I'm really enjoying Annihilation and Throw in uh, multiplayer, it's been good fun man, 
Those are <laughs> the combo explosions for the powers. They're pretty fun. But I do, I do miss like old classic Mass Effect 2 kind of combat. But like, I think we can all admit Mass Effect 1 was a bit like crazy. Like you're overpowered as heck. Like you could literally be in immortal as a soldier in Mass Effect 1, right? <laughs> so it's like, yeah, it's a bit more chill now. I don't like the uh, multiplayer for Mass Effect 3's, um, how you gotta, like, EA's obviously gotten into it, you gotta do all those packs and stuff, like, uh, the whole Battlegrounds, uh, loot boxes scenario, it's pretty much that, you know, you got, like, little loot boxes, but it doesn't take too long to, um, well, it kinda does, but it doesn't, but yeah, it's just, yeah, it'll take a while to unlock everything, put it that way, man. <laughs> It'd be nice if they uh, updated and changed that a bit. Uh, but yeah, like, and so far the plot's been alright, uh, I don't know what it's going to be like at the end. Uh, I don't mind it so far. A couple of the side quests are like, they just kind of die out, they're like, oh, I finished it? When did I do that? And then, did I get XP for that? I don't know. <laughs> hey, but, uh... Yeah, um, you know, the graphics, I'm really enjoying, like, the remnant, uh, what are they called, the, uh, remnant ruins, or, and vaults, that's what that was, the remnant vaults, where, like, they've got the gravity wells and stuff, and it's, like, little, yeah, it's just really pretty, really, like, it's a really nice kind of, like, the game looks nice, is, in my opinion. And, you know, gameplay is, combat and stuff is, you know, Mass Effect kind of level solid. And that, that's what I enjoy about the games. But the, so far the story has been not terrible. Uh, you know, it's average, I guess. But still kind of like, I want to know where it's going. So I haven't finished it yet, obviously. <laughs> but uh, that's just because I'm working too much. But I'll get there. I like 100% a planet's uh, viability, <laughs> like, in a few... Oh, I don't even know. Was it the second planet? It didn't take long at all, man. I was like, oh, I'm done already? Alright, cool. Moving on to the next one. As I'm leveling up, I'm getting more competent in the uh, fights, because insanity is like... It's actually like crazy how accurate the enemies are with their guns, as you probably all know across any game with a high difficulty setting where the uh, <laughs> game developer is just like you know what we'll just make it hit them all the time no problem oh shoot Rena just got wrecked <laughs> shield you wanted a shield nah bro <laughs> oh this immortality thing like yeah, I was gonna say, they're not stealing HP from the boss, are they? Nah. I don't even remember what their uh, passive is. It looks like it was. That was. I could say, that was Light Vampire, wasn't it? Doesn't he, like, steal HP from his allies or something? I don't know. To, like, not die? <coughs> I wonder if, he's, if he can't steal it from the boss, does that make them immortal? <laughs> I didn't. I wasn't looking properly. Did Rena's HP go down? I'll check later in the video, once it's done. <laughs> oh, You guys will just be able to get back and check it. Eh, whatever. <coughs> mm, but yeah. No, I've been enjoying that one. And I got, a, I got a few games backed up, so next will probably be like... what I get? This is on my, like I'm mostly a PC gamer, plus you know Summoner's War, and then uh, I've got a PS4 up in the bedroom, so I chill on that. And that's where I'm playing Mass Effect Andromeda. But I've got like a few games backed up on there, like um, Deus Ex, the the newer one. I forget what the subtitle for it was, but you guys will know what it is. Um, I still haven't played through that man, so I'll be I'll be playing through that one. Probably after Andromeda, and then I gotta. I'm like, I'm like debating whether to pick up the new Monster Hunter World game for 
PS4 or for PC, because my PC needs a new graphics card. So I'm like, oh man, do I do I build a new PC and like play one of my like 2,000 plus Steam games, <laughs> or do I get a Monster Hunter on PS4 where it's not going to look as pretty as it will on PC? Potential for modding and things like that, and just yeah, gloriousness. But who knows, right? Figure that out later when I got time for it. It's not actually, uh, let's see. There you go, guys. 20 minutes for stage 23. Hey! <laughs> so, what, like a minute per level? Alright. It'd certainly be a lot quicker with, um,. AoEs again. This is why I'm like, if if you know you guys use three star monsters, like this game is so ridiculously simple to clear with three star monsters. <laughs> I'm not saying you're gonna get legend rank in PvP with them, but hey, worth a shot, man. Like that, uh, what is it, that water elemental dude, Inferno, the water Inferno or whatever they're called. Um. With the 50% attack gauge increase and crit damage buff. I mean, sorry, not crit damage, crit rate buff. Like, come on. That's that's like, you throw your sweet, like your speed rings on that dude. And then just go crazy. And just, yeah, kill things. Too easy, right? Hmm. Like, you can get away with all kinds of, like, builds and stuff doing that kind of thing. So, what I'm thinking, I'll knock you out to... Oh. Yeah. <laughs> singing. Yeah, too easy, guys. I was thinking, maybe I'll knock out stage 25. Yeah. Just use up the energy. Because uh, I've just been notified my food's ready, so <laughs> I'll knock out uh, knock out the last of this energy, and then I might uh, jump back into it afterwards and knock out some more levels. Just quick clear, well not quick really. Eh? We were just talking about that, <laughs> but yeah, guys, like you know, you're gonna get four star monsters. You're gonna get five stars, like. There's always this thing like, I've been playing three years and I've got two Footnote fives, and it's like, guys, you clearly don't play much, or you're not. Like, if you buy enough of those premium packs with the crystals, which, remember how I was talking earlier, if you do like World Boss and TOA and stuff, you'll get plenty of crystals, guys. Like, just buy premium packs. Like, everyone's like, oh, use them for recharges, you'll get more, um... You know, you'll get more Mystic Scrolls that way, but like, sure, probably, that's, you know, what the dudes that know the math do, but like, if if you really want Net 5, just buy the premium packs, keep farming as you do, and, and that many summons, that many Mystic Scrolls, you're going to get Net 5s. Like, I think I've got like, at least, maybe 10 or 12 on my main account. I know I'm close to that, but I use my, I mostly use my Nat 4s because they're just, yeah, <laughs> like, the mon monsters are situational, I'm not going to use freaking Poseidon in um, Raid 5, even though he's got like, the attack gauging decrease, I'm not going to throw him in there just because he's a uh, Nat 5, you know, <laughs> sorry, the attack gauge decrease in a slow, because like, What's skill block gonna do? There's nothing. It doesn't do anything. And his like his one is kind of his first skill. It's kind of handy to throw back oblivion sometimes if it goes on. But like he's probably just gonna get stunned anyway. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> uh, but yeah, like, monsters are situational. Grogo here two star. Ramagod two star. Like man, I had this dude arguing that. Fight Ifrit was a better rep than Remagos, and I'm like, Fight Ifrit isn't gonna solo Giants B10. Just saying, you know. 
Like, this dude is like a 2 3 star gold PvPer. And he's not understanding that uh, <laughs> Fire Effort isn't gonna help as an actual rap monster uh, that can only do certain things <laughs> for uh, other players. He's gonna, like, what, be used to farm one level. Congratulations. You know, meanwhile, Ramagos can, like, clear the entire game. <laughs> and, uh, oh, you know, obviously he's not going to do, like, raid on his own and stuff, but I'm talking, like, places where you can actually use rep monsters. You know, like, you know, you, you want reps for, like, giants and stuff. For, like, new newbies, if you're going to add them. And, or you want them to, uh, clear, uh, scenarios for farming. So, you know, I wouldn't use Ramagos as a rep for, um, you know, like, I mean, I suppose I could, you know, use it for Aiden and stuff for, like, other people, because it would take, it, it takes a while to clear, because it's Ramagos, you know, he's slow, but, like, you know, you, you get, like, uh, Anything that can solo, like, Dragons B10, Giants B10, <laughs> nothing's going to solo Necro B10, but, you know, those make far better reps, because they can do more than one thing, <laughs> which is going to help both newbies and older players. Like, maybe they won't use it for uh, clearing Giants and Dragons, but you could use it for your ult, and get that Dark Scroll, re-roll repeatedly if that's your thing. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> Just saying, it's... As a rep monster, it, it's gonna... It's... It, yeah. <laughs> you want something that can clear more than one scenario. See our rap there? He is a good monster for uh, farming with. For those newbies watching this, if at all, get a rap, man. Use that for farming. Uh, Fireman? It will, like, obliterate Feynman. You throw good, uh... Boom. You throw good, uh, damage runes on him. As long as he one-shots those monsters, it'll be one-shot, 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 one-shot. Clear. One-shot, 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 one-shot. Clear. And you're all good. <laughs> See, look at this. Stage 30. Still going, guys. <laughs> Hmm. Anyways, of course you're, uh, you know, welcome to disagree <laughs> with my opinions, if you uh, like, but, yeah. <laughs> the only thing I'm lacking is ruin quality. That's pretty much what any of us are lacking in this game. <laughs> Look at this. Bam. Just like... Before the Bernards could even move. There you go, guys. Anyways, that's stage 30 clear. I'll, uh, I'll summon that scroll before uh, anything else. Yeah, daily's rolled over. Let's see. I might do some summons in uh, the next one. But uh, for now, I'm going to do some food. Oh, oh, what's this? Oh, oh, I'm not sure I have him yet. That's cool. Huh. There you go, guys. Let's see. Yes. See, I built my uh, Winvalk. Got her ready. And do I have this guy? Oops. Uh, no. There you go, guys. You just witnessed me getting a monster I don't have. Yay, lightning. That's what we like to see, right? <laughs> I'm thinking of, like, upping this guy using later levels for TOA because of those fire monsters. <laughs> Alright guys, uh, that's it for now. See you on the next one. Oops. <laughs>